Hello everybody, my name is Khaled Siddiqui and in today's video I'm going to review a very nice little compact tabletop tripod that I bought from Amazon. Uh, I found this tripod really uh, interesting and helpful for your uh, YouTubers or any other uh, videographers or photographers who would like to uh, create nice and professional videos. So here's what I like most about it. Uh, this little unit is a, a newer N-E-E-W-E-R newer model M225 plus CK30 and the features that I really liked about this unit which I don't uh, see in any other models is the fact that it can do complete 180 degree flat tabletop setup so you could set this up completely uh, you know 180 degrees like this and uh, as you can see from here you could you know twist your camera either direction and you have movements this way that way and you have a water leveling meter here on the top which you can see and uh, and uh, you have a it, it would help if they had another uh, water leveling instrument on this side but you know even on the side it's pretty good gives you leveling and uh, each one of these uh, legs can be extended further let me show you so you could extend each one further and uh, it gets up to I would say a good foot and a half there now that's a good two feet extended and uh, then you could of course close them by twisting them counterclockwise like that uh, it locks in when you uh, close when you twist it clockwise and counterclockwise it locks in and uh, for those of you who speak British English that is um, uh, clockwise and anti-clockwise uh, English uh, British English speakers and American English speakers, it's clockwise and counterclockwise, like that. So now it's locked, unlocked, and then it will extract and go in. Uh, this little thingy allows you to twist it and lock it in this position, which is more like 30 degree angle, or take it out and open it all the way to nearly nearly 90 degree it's a little less than 90 degree so if you open both sides you have nearly 180 degree but not quite maybe 160 or 70 but here's the most interesting part of this little tripod once you extend all of these legs to to maximum length now this I haven't seen in most like cheap tripod this was this was pretty reasonably an expensive tripod I mean it wasn't a very expensive one okay so I want to extend all the legs to the maximum there you go there you go so I'm gonna twist them to lock them in place and watch what I, what I can do I can open this center I can open this all the way, take this out all together, and mount this upside down. I haven't seen this feature in many high-end tripods. So now I can mount my camera at the bottom of the tripod for a close-up shot like this. So 
see how that works. So you basically mount your camera at the bottom. Like this. Okay. So, and then you can of course do the same here. You could go up and down. As you can see, you can go up and down. And uh, you can even reduce the height, providing if your camera leaves you enough room. There, it basically collapses to really, really small size, like that. And then you can open and mount it the normal way again. You have to open this. And there you go. And now you can put it back on the top and close this. And now you have it back in the normal way. So this is good for videography and for uh, photography uh, because uh, the reason it's good for videography and photography is that uh, the ball head on the top can twist all the way to 90 degrees on the side for like, uh, you know, vertical photography if you want to take picture of someone standing up or a tall building so you could do that you could do you know twist it sideways this way and then you can come on top twist it this way this is a very easy release this is where you you know hook up your camera to this unit and it's very easy to remove and put it back in And uh, yeah, it's pretty, pretty neat, pretty neat. And it's pretty compact. It's less than, less than a foot when you put it all together. And uh, so, yeah, I really like it. I really like it. Now, this unit is not very expensive. It's uh, like under $50. Uh, actually, it's under $30, uh, $40. Under, it was 30 something, 35 or something which is pretty good for, for what it does. And the quality is really, really sturdy. I mean, this thing you can, can handle your Canon 5D Mark IV, uh, Mark III. It's, it's, uh, it, it can, you know, it's very, very sturdy, very strong, very well, well built. And it's a, a newer model, let's see, M225 plus CK30. All right. Okay, I hope you like this review video. By the way, this uh, video wasn't sponsored by the manufacturer. I voluntarily uh, reviewed this and, uh, you know, gave you my input on it. Uh, so it's completely unbiased and honest opinion. Thank you for watching. Please don't forget to like and subscribe.